okay so in this video we'll be the solving a sample problem here in which we need to determine the maximum value of p that will not permit large compression effects okay we also need to take note that the column is laterally braced on its weak axis now we have a figure here in which uh, one end is uh, fixed support babaw din ang isaya din din the other end is a it's a roller roller type na support niya now we have a quantity force in which it is applied at an eccentricity of 750 okay and then ang iya brace length din nato din is around 4.5 okay I chose this uh, particular na kwan problem because ang iyahang kwan din eh, yung figure, figure sa to ang structural member is not, uh, it's very unusual, okay? Ang um, previous lessons na to din eh, we have uh, previous examples, just mostly kwan sa naka ng mga simply supported, okay? To bihira lagi kung nakakitaan ni na classing problem. Anyway, ang iyang gikwan din eh, corresponding na gigamit na case sa uh, kwan, kasulat, is around 0 0.7, okay? 0 0.7, and we have an kwan din din eh, we have also solved na nga tuang kwan, bending stress na to, allowable bending stress, which is equal to FB is equal to 150 MPA, FY is equal to 248 MPA, and our E is equal to 200,000 MPA or 200 gigapascal. I'm just uh, reading through an uh, just in case if dili kayo klaro ang reception sa kong video so so that everyone else will uh, will be able to follow the property uh properties aning kwan gamit na kwan na tong beam by the way uh rather column is this uh w6 by 20 na i section okay this is a corresponding area of 3790 square millimeters sectional cross sectional area our IX then ani say uh, centroidal inner, uh, moment of inertia with respect to x-axis 17,231,980 uh, millimeters to the fourth power. We have our D here, which is equal to 157 depth sa ang kwan I section is 157 millimeters, and we have our X here radius of gyration with respect to x direction, which is equal to 67. Point 429 millimeters. Okay. We need to check ang uh, kwan niya, ang maximum value ni P na dili siya mo kwan permit og large compression. Now, that's the the case. Tut lang. If that's the case then din eh kwan tan sana ka nang step by step ang atong procedure lang sa ani. First, uh, kung kwan, first na approach ani siya, uh, would, uh, would go with kwan sa una katong sa column analysis, then bending da yun, then kato ding actual interaction, da, ay kato ding kwan, uh, criterions na da yun niya, okay? Now, sa tuwang case diri, uh, kwan sa tao na, column analysis, okay? Ana sa, ana sa tao na column analysis. Now, when you say column analysis gani, naman tong short column o long column, di ba? I think, uh, ma-remember na ninyo ang kanina mga kwan pag-evaluate na na sa iya. First, uh, we need to solve for sa tong compression index. Ba? Which is equal to uh, pi r squared 200,000 I believe this is a unitless na kwan FY is equal to pilagin siya si FY hmm, 248 MPA MPA okay I hope makita na nyo din eh uh, this cancels out this is supposed to be a unitless na kwan value of 126.169 ba? Muna itong gahimun first step na to when we're de dealing with column analysis. CC o KL over R. Now, KL over R din ta. Uh, that should be 
equal to hmm okay I thought na wala na ko nag record ng video <laughs> KLK is equal to 0.7 multiplied by L na to the which is uh, 4500 millimeters okay divided by na punisyon sa ubus na to radius of gyration is 67.429 millimeters okay all the millimeters cancels out we have the slenderness ratio on isayaha which is equal to 46.71580 okay Mm. So, makita din na to diri that KL over R is less than our compression index. Therefore, our column is column is not slender. Okay? Dili siya slender. So, dili siya long column. We're dealing with a uh, short column din eh. Mm. So, kana siya. Ah, napatay gusto, napoy gusto yung moon. Before tamo embark ka na siya, I think it's uh, also quite very convenient. So, kwa na, kwa siya list down daan. So, KL over R, KL over R over CC. That is just 46.71580 divided by 126.1. 0.169 okay that should be equal to ah tarin lang no isulat 0 0.37026 okay KL over RCC is equal to kani and our column is not slender allow me to make room sa okay so we have uh, this na din mm. short column man sa Nya, kabalo na scale over RCC. So, atong procedure ana say as you can remember. Ah, safety factor that is equal to 5 over 3 plus 3 over 8 KL over RCC minus uh, 1 over 8 KL over RCC cubed, okay? So, fa kuan siyang ibutang din yang mga kuan. This is the reason why ako siyang ikwan. I-solve na daan. Kaya para dili na akong mag-input. Ugdagan kayo numbers bitaw. That's the problem with dun sa naka ng mga very long solutions. Because there's a great tendency to create mga kwan ka ng mga kinagmay na mistakes. So, input na ng mga values dun sa calculator as much as possible keep it sim simplified even though mas dagan siya steps okay pero just so the more the steps the easier for it for you to kwansa na ka ng recount balik asa ka kasayop okay so input na ko ni sa diri I will have the SF of kani uh, finally then diri I can also for FA okay FA is equal to 1 minus uh, 1 half KL over RCC squared multiplied by FY over SF. Okay, so this is just equal to sa one minus um, one half zero point three seven zero two six squared. FY is equal to sa two hundred forty eight MPA divided by our SF then which is equal to 1.79917 Okay So, if at one siyang ma input ni data, we will have an FA of equal to 128.395 megapascals Okay So, we have something like this then. Okay so now man naman ta so much for column analysis now we move on to small compression yan na condition okay uh, 
When talk about small compression condition, that, that means dili siya mag-go beyond 0.15 nga kwan. Criteria niya. Nga dapat ma-satisfy din yang kanina kwan na equation para pasar sa kanina criterion. Anyway, we have uh, FA and FBX. Okay? Atong wala na balaan din ni kay kini si FBY. Pa? Wala takabalon si value na niya. Uh, next na sa ito question din din eh, kanisya, kanisya, kanisya. Kanisya ng mga 3 terms na lang itong kinanglan ni Kwan, i-define din eh. Now, when you talk about FA gan eh, um, FA, kanisya din eh, that is just on sa, hmm, sakit no? Kaning, force over area, ba? That is just our Kwan din eh, itong ito ang basic lang na actual force niya na Kwan. Um, we have P, di ba? Divided by ang area na to, which is equal to 3,790 divided by 1,000 squared. Okay? Uh, I'm dividing this by 1,000 squared, diri, kay para kung saan ka ng 1,000 squared. Para may mo siya kung ka ng meters. Okay? So, that will correspond to 263.850P. Okay? Muna siya itong FA. Now, sa so kanina siya na case na sa dayon din eh, FBX, that should be, yun sa, equal to, kuan, MY over I, di ba? I think this is our, kuan, strength of materials, no, kuan, concept niya. M, MY over I, in which this is the IX na to, and yeah, kanina din siya, this is just the uh, D over 2, okay? Divide na to ni siyang, kuan. That is just the location sa kwan katong fiber bitaw. Uh, extreme stress fiber. So, ang moment sa din nato din diri, that is just equal to eccentricity times ang atong force, which is equal to sa um, 0.75p. Okay? Hmm. Now, if I were to label this uh, 0.75p, d nato, which is equal to. 157 divided by 2 hmm 0.157 divided by 2 okay try to keep everything consistent dapat consistent ang inyong kwanda ni units this is 0.157 divided by 2 that is in meters okay divided by ix ix is equal to 17 980 divided by so muna siya hmm, for the power of 4 muna siya kung kanda ni uh, hinlo na kung siya din ni I will find that FBX is equal to hmm 3416.613p okay muna siya itong makwanda ni these are the values na itong makwanda makam up try to explain uh, express everything in terms of P. Okay? Kini siya. Now, we have one more concern na lang sa dayon, Ba? BY. We do not have a moment na gakwan. Gahapin sa Y-axis. Gabin sa iya dito. So, we could just say nandiyan na rin na FBY by default is just equal to zero. Hmm. We go back to this equation daw, Dayan. FA over A, that should be equal to, unsa man to siya? FA na to is equal to 263.850P, ba? Divided by 128. Point, hmm. Ah, okay. 128, ato po siya ikuan this is in megapascal so multiply by 1000 natay kuanda ni this is in terms of kilopascals na okay now this is for this uh kaning first na term kaning kaning siya second term sa dayon that is equal to fbx is equal to 3416.613 p it is to be divided by fbx na capital 152 100,000 okay 
Finally, the inconition theory, FBY is equal to zero, divided by what the balance number na say ah the hell we care. Anyway, what is that? Tung kano nanda na? What the balance number na niya? That should be equal to or less than one. Okay, one point zero. So I just set this as equal kagi pangayo man yung maximum na value sa p. We're talking about an optimization din eh. Kasi pinaka maximum value na niya na wala ra siya niya about sa kwan. Large compression. Okay? So, there's a compromise na. Now, we have everything here din eh. Ako lang niya siyang i-koan. We can now solve for P na da yun. This is just 0. And then, we can now solve for P. Which is just equal to nun sa 40.762 kilo newtons okay this is our value of p based lang sa criterion gidefine sa kwan uh, non large compression effect okay well even though natay nguna ni eh, nat value niya na p ato sa dako ni try ug kwan find out if It is really, kung saan na ka ito, non-large compression siya. Small compression na sa taman. Now, what I will do lang din din is say, I have the value of P. I divide it by the area. Okay? And I will have FA na da yun. Ba? FA is equal to P, which is equal to P over kung saan. 762 divided by, saan man siya diri? area which is equal to 3790 this is an mm 1000 squared yeah kung ano siya divide by 1000 po din eh para makuha siya anyway that should end up becoming ano siya um ano ra 10.7 Um, we have 10.755, okay? Where was I? Ah, 10.755 megapascals, okay? And after this, uh, and after this, uh, I will have the FA. We already have the FF 128.395, so I think we can verify na dyan that FA over FA is equal to 10.755 divided by 128.395 megapascals. Megapascals. This cancels out. And we will have a value of 0.08376, okay? That is way below sa ito ang benchmark na 0.15. So, there, makuha nyo na ito siya, ma-satisfy yun na ito na siyang kanan na klaseng expression dahil na 0.15. Okay? That falls under the category of small compression, so... I don't think kwan niya. This is a at least consistent ang atong criteria sa dini. Okay. So much for this sample problem. Everything is self-explanatory.